have a little of the truth. Father Seuss, we await you. We crave the pleasure of your company at supper and perhaps a tale or two of Aphrodite. I refuse to enter into any kind of vulgar baldry. Then you shall tell us why we find you lacking near our lines. That should prove equally entertaining. Take him, lad. And two of you there, take off this carrier. Have a care. Do not touch me. <laughs> <laughs> you will pay for this, Odysseus. Ah, will I? We shall see. This much must we do for the Lord Achilles, lest none believe his story. <laughs> you will not laugh so loud, I think, when Agamemnon hears of this. I'm sure he's been taken prisoner. Oh, come on. The big man was laughing. Didn't look as though the doctor made a joke. Anyway, we don't even know where we are. Well, the doctor said there were Greeks. We're probably in Greece. Oh, but that would be wonderful, wouldn't it? We might meet the heroes. We might... Those men who carried off the doctor wouldn't be heroes or anything like them. That's why I've got to go and get him. Well, I'm coming with you. And how far do you think you can get on that ankle? Not so bad. Now I... I'll manage. No, you stay here. Rest your ankle, watch the scanners, you'll be perfectly safe. When you see the doctor and me coming, open the doors. But not otherwise. But no, we mustn't... I haven't got time to argue. I want to get to the doctor before they cut his head off. Now stay here. Goodbye. I hope you find the doctor, that's all. Menelaus. I've told you about it before. Why can't you learn to behave like a king instead of a dropsical old camp follower? Have a little dignity. Try to remember that you're my brother, can't you? One of the reasons I drink Agamemnon is to forget that I am your brother. Another is this ridiculous Trojan expedition. We've been here for ten years. I want to go home. So I'm not getting any younger. You won't get any older if you talk to me like that, brother or no brother. What's the matter with you, man? Don't you want to get Helen back? Don't you, don't you want to see your wife again? Quite frankly, no. You must know, I was heartily glad to see the back of that. <laughs> Why do you talk like that in front of these? It wasn't the first time she'd allowed herself to be abducted. I can't keep on going off to the ends of the earth to get her back. It makes me a laughing stuff. Now, you knew perfectly well what she was like before you married her. Besides, this is a question of honor to get her back. Family honor, don't you understand? No, not to mention the trade routes through the Bostrums, of course. Well, what have they got to do with it? It isn't enough for you that you control the Achaean League, is it? Now you want to take over Asia Minor as well. Only King Priam of Troy stands in your way. May I remind you that these ambitions would have been served just as well if you had killed Paris in single combat as you were expected. Yes, and I don't do. interrupt us. Brown would have been quite prepared to let this contest settle the issue between us. Yes, but don't and blame me because you've landed us into a full-scale war. Yes, but I did challenge Paris, if you remember, ten years ago. But I wouldn't accept. <laughs> He's just about as cowardly as you are. For the last time, I am not a coward. Well, in that case, why didn't you challenge someone else? Anyone. Challenge Hector. Hector? Yeah, Hector? Are you mad? Well, that'd be suicide. Well, you don't know until you've tried it, do you? <laughs> you know, I think that's a very good idea of yours. Oh, so you want to see me killed, is that it? Is nothing sacred to you? A uh, brother's honor. Oh, Paul, I hold that more sacred than anything else. That's why I shall issue the challenge in the morning on your bar. Right, on my bar. Hey, King. Hector is dead. What? How did this happen? This very day. I slew him after an hour or more of single combat. Oh, you did. Oh, dear. There's another good idea wasted. And what do you mean, wasted? Here oh, have I yes, been yes, fighting... Yes, 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 yes. It's only that Menelaus was just about to challenge him. I don't think I'm not pleased with what you've done. I am. Sit down. 
Tell us all about it. But I have other more important news, and there isn't much time. What more important than the death of Hector? At the height of my battle with Hector, there came a sudden lightning flash, and Zeus appeared before me. Zeus? Huh? Hey? It's all right. He's been listening to too much propaganda, haven't you, Achilles? <laughs> you mustn't take so much notice of that. Look, I tell you, it's true. He appeared to me from nowhere in the in the shape of a little old man. Hmm. Where is he now, this little old Zeus? He was about to accompany me here when Odysseus and his men arrived. They took him prisoner. They what? Odysseus mocked him. Then they seized him and are bringing him to camp. I ran ahead to warn you. You did well. Odysseus, take Odysseus. He can't be too careful in matters like this. He may, in fact, be Zeus. Dad, go find the Lord Odysseus. Command his presence here. Who dares command Odysseus? For I can be not easy to you. Well, we will not quarrel when we have a guest of such importance. Here's this old man. Claims to be our father, Zeus. <laughs> <laughs> you may rise. I am most displeased who is in command here. I have that honor. As I have always understood. Yet this month, Bank Odysseus appears to be a law unto himself. He makes fun of his guests and laughs at Zeus. He will be reprimanded if you are indeed who you say you are. If I am not a god, how do you account for my supernatural knowledge? Hmm? Knowledge of what? I can tell you one or two things that might surprise you. Huh? Name one. Your wife, for instance, is unfaithful to you. What? <laughs> Everyone knows that. <laughs> I, I never heard it. Everyone that is except you and him, of course. <laughs> <laughs> I will not have my wife's name banded about like that. Besides, we have no way of checking on your slanderous assertions. Divinely inspired or no? What do you advise? Then treat me with honor and return me to my temple before I really become angry. No, I tell you, Agamemnon, he has come to help us. If huh? I were an enemy, what could one man do, do alone and unarmed against the glory that is Greece? Hmm? The glory that is Greece? Hmm? A neat phrase. The man is a spy. Deal with him and be brief, or I shall undertake it for you. After I am dead, Odysseus, and only dead. If you shall insist, I shall be most happy to oblige, Lightfoot. Silence! This is time for thought, not sword play. Uh, since my thoughts are of such little account, allow me to withdraw. Forgive him, Father Zeus. The man is a bore. If you command me, I will deal with him. No, with no, Achilles, leave him. Why try to kill him now, when you are in sight of victory? Hmm? Huh? <laughs> you prophesy as much as that? I could almost guarantee it. Almost? Oh, not another ten years. But first, I would like to know, am I to be treated as a god or as an enemy? If you kill me now, it will probably cost you the war. Yes, that is so. On the other hand, if we don't kill you and you are a spy, the same thing might happen. I propose to place you under arrest. Arrest? But I must return to my tie in my temple. A reverend arrest. You must not be offended. We shall enjoy the benefit of your experience and your advice, and in return you will enjoy our hospitality. Do you have? Excellent. Do sit down and have a ham bone. Oh. Uh -huh. 